Five of the hottest spring color trends is exactly what I'm about to share in this video. So if you love spring fashion as much as I do, then grab your coffee or your wine or your drink of choice, whatever time of day it is, and get comfortable because this is going to be one amazing video. Now make sure you listen to this entire video because I have just turned 50 years old back in November and I have started dating because I have been divorced for a while and so I'm going to be sharing a new dating story with you guys at the end of the video so if you're interested in that please stick around I want to thank Halara for sponsoring this video Halara is one of my absolute favorite fashion forward athleisure brands they offer the best like performance fabric you guys when I'm telling you this fabric is so soft it is so high quality it doesn't wrinkle it feels good on my skin and so a couple of these looks in this video are from Halara and as always, everything I'm talking about will be linked down below in my description box. And another thing I love about Halara is everything is extremely budget friendly. Spring color trend number one, and this might just be my favorite, and that is baby blue. Now leave me a comment down below and let me know if you love wearing baby blue as much as I do. Honestly, if I had to pick like the number one color whenever I wear it, I get the most compliments it would be baby blue. So I try to wear that color as much as possible because I don't know about you, but it just feels good to get a compliment. So you guys, these are some light blue joggers from Halara. Let me tell you, they are the most flattering joggers I have ever tried on. Honestly, I'm not a lover of joggers. Well, I wasn't a lover of joggers until I tried these on because I typically think most joggers look very frumpy. They look sloppy. They just kind of look ick and kind of give me that ick feeling. But these, insane because they're high-waisted. Like I said, the fabric is so soft and they're just very slimming because they're almost like really fitted like a legging however they do have the drawstring waist so they're obviously a jogger super chic you can work out in these joggers but then you could also let go run errands in them you could go to like a casual lunch i'm actually driving to austin tomorrow to visit my daughter and this is the exact outfit i'll be wearing i went with a white workout tank this is also from halara i love the strappy sexy back uh, this is a great tank it is ribbed it's a bit on the cropped side but it doesn't show any skin when you pair it with these fabulous high-waisted joggers from halara it does have pads in it i did take the pads out because i just don't love workout tops with the pads in them but it's really good to know that you have that option and then how fabulous is this sheer bomber jacket from halara i love this white bomber jacket because it is sheer it's lightweight it's like the perfect chicest most fashion forward workout jacket i have owned in a really long time i love the fact that it has this really cool zipper you can leave it unzipped and wear it as a jacket it, but you could also zip it up and wear it zipped up just kind of whatever your preference is I personally love wearing jackets unzipped but love this easy peasy athleisure look from Halara now this is another fabulous athleisure look now don't get me wrong there are going to be several athleisure looks in this video but there's also going to be some just regular casual looks and some dressier looks so there is a wide variety no matter what your lifestyle so i think you will really love all of the outfits in this video but this is a great denim jacket uh, of course it's the baby blue color it's by frame denim so i love that brand of denim this jacket is sort of distressed so it's very edgy, very casual, very easy. I got this last season, but it's still fully stocked. And I just love a jean jacket. I think they're so versatile. You can wear them with so many different things. I just paired it over an easy black tank top. And then these are the black Halara joggers. Again, so slimming, so flattering. I love the material. It's very high performance. It's wrinkle free. It feels really good on my skin. And the price point on these joggers is very budget friendly. However, they're extremely high quality. Now this is another baby blue outfit. This one is a little bit more dressy, but it is also from Halara. So this is a fabulous denim midi skirt. It looks like it's denim, you guys, but it's really not true denim. It's actually more of like this softer material. 
so it's more comfortable than wearing jeans, but you get the look like you're wearing denim, so you look actually a little bit more dressy than you actually are. It is high-waisted. I love the slit up the front. And denim midi skirts are having a huge moment this season in 2024, so I will say I'm a big fan of this fabulous faux denim skirt from Halara. And then I just paired it with this ivory off the shoulder top. This is a great spring and summer top. You could wear it with skirts, you can wear it with denim, you could wear it with shorts even. Like literally the possibilities are endless because this tastefully sexy off the shoulder top is just fabulous. And I really love this ivory shade. You could sort of wear it square. You don't have to wear it off the shoulder if you don't want to, but I personally love wearing it off the shoulder because remember ladies no matter what your size our shoulders are always a sexy part of our body that you can show if you're comfortable and confident doing so and then i just went with my silver heels you guys these heels are fantastic and silver is another big trend we're seeing in 2024 i love these silver heels because they look like some premium designer heels but because they're from revolve and by like a regular designer they're a fraction of the price they're actually pretty comfortable as well because the heel height is only a couple of inches and i love this pointy toe they're going to do a great job of making your legs look longer and you look taller and slimmer. The second spring color that we are seeing a ton of all over celebrities, all over mega influencers, and that is light gray. So I love light gray paired with lighter colors like ivory, like blush pink. I think those color combinations just scream spring. So I was really happy to find out that light gray was a big spring color this year. So these Halara joggers come in this beautiful light gray shade, you guys. I love these pants. I'm actually wearing them today after I film this video. I'm going to be going to a decorating place to pick out some backsplash and a countertop because you guys, I just bought a brand new condo. It's actually not new. It's like 25 years old, but new to me. So I'm super excited about that. And this is the exact outfit I'm going to be wearing because I want to look cute, but then I also want to be very casual and very comfortable. So I paired these joggers with the same white tank and then this fabulous sheer bomber jacket you guys i know i'm going to be living in this bomber jacket all season long and i'm sure if you decide to get it too you will be also another way to wear this light denim shade is with some jeans so these are an amazing pair of light gray jeans from abercrombie and fitch you guys, if you've never tried Abercrombie & Fitch denim, you will love these jeans under $100. And trust me when I say they fit and feel like designer denim. This is a high-waisted straight leg denim silhouette, which is all the rage right now in the denim world. The good news is this exact denim silhouette comes in like 10 different washes, like light denim, dark denim, rips, no rips, obviously this beautiful light gray shade. So if you love this style of denim, I would order it in several different colors because I always say if you find something that fits well like order it in multiple colors which is exactly why I ordered those Halara joggers in multiple colors because I love them so much and the fit is amazing so I pair these amazing gray jeans with this really cool bomber jacket this is a beautiful pale gray bomber jacket I think it's from anthropology it's a great price point it is a bit on the crop side it's lightweight I love this jacket because it can be super casual and worn with sneakers but then you can also wear it with heels so that's why I really love this versatile bomber jacket so I did do an ivory faux leather corset top. This is a great top, very affordable, perfect for a date night or a girl's night out. And then I went with some silver metallic heels since metallic heels are so on trend right now. Now my friend Kathy styled this same bomber jacket but with sneakers and then these fabulous gray pants from Aritzia. I love these pants because they're easy. They're a dark charcoal gray color. So still embodying that spring denim trend of gray it doesn't have to be light gray it can also be dark gray but i really do think that light gray is a bit more springish looking if you will the third spring color trend we are seeing a ton of this season is white specifically white dresses it doesn't have to be a dressy dress it can be a dressy dress but it can also be a casual dress now obviously white isn't just a trending color. It's basically a very classic and timeless color that's never gonna go out of style. And I love wearing white because it's fresh, it's modern, and it always looks chic and sophisticated. 
So this is a super casual look. I don't know if you're a tennis player like me, or maybe you play pickleball. I love playing pickleball too. I honestly don't get to play it as much, but this is the perfect dress for tennis or pickleball or just running around, running errands. It's a fabulous dress from Halara. It has built-in shorts. It has a built-in bralette. Again, this high performance material is so soft. It's so easy. And I love the straps in the back. It's the perfect length too. What I do find with a lot of these tennis dresses is they are a bit too short, but I think this one is perfect. And just for reference, I am five foot four. Now you don't have to wear solid white. Another color combination that's trending hard this spring is black and white. So this is an amazing white blazer. It's by Veronica Beard. I really love these strong shoulder pads. And then I paired it over this fabulous Halara bustier top. It's like a faded black denim. Again, it looks like black denim, but it's not real denim. It's more of like this really soft material. So again, it's really comfortable and it gives the illusion that you're dressed up more than you really are because again, it's not real denim. It's just like this super soft material, but I love a good bustier top. I think they're so fabulous for a date night or a girl's night out. And then I just paired them with my absolute favorite vegan leather flares. These are by Veronica Beard, probably one of my most slimming high-waisted flare pants in my closet, hands down. I love these pants. They hug your curves in all the right places. And the material is just like super buttery soft and it just makes you look super tall and super slim. Another way to wear white is to wear ivory. So this is a fabulous ivory denim midi skirt. This one is by Good American. I love this mini skirt because it does have a slit up the front. It is high waisted. The fit is impeccable. And I just know that this ivory denim skirt will go a long way in any woman's wardrobe. I know I will be personally wearing it a ton this season. And I paired it with this amazing Free People bodysuit. This is a beautiful blue shade. You guys, how gorgeous is this blue color? This bodysuit, I think it's like under $50, so what a steal. It does come in multiple colors, including black. Now, it does come down pretty low in the front, so what I did to combat that is I paired it over this really cool faux leather bustier top. I just think it kind of created a really tastefully sexy look. I'm actually gonna go to dinner tonight with a girlfriend, and I think this is the exact look that I'll be wearing. All right, the next color that's trending hard this spring is sage green. Really any color of green, but specifically sage. So I really love the color green. I think it looks amazing on most skin tones and almost any hair color. So this is a really beautiful sage green. It's a little bit darker than a sage green. It's a beautiful cropped trench coat. It is wrinkle free. It looks way more expensive than it really is. It has these really beautiful buttons on it as well. I think a trench coat is classic. It's timeless. It's modern. It's sophisticated looking. And I love the fact that this one is a bit on the cropped side because I don't know about you, but when I wear a long trench coat, like don't get me wrong, I think that's very beautiful, very chic, but I'm five foot four. So anytime I wear a long coat, I just feel like it swallows me up. So I'm always happy to find a jacket like a cropped trench because I know it's going to look perfect on my five foot four frame. And I went with the same gray Abercrombie and Fitch jeans, proving their versatility and wearability. Another way to wear green this season is with this fabulous light olive blank NYC cargo jacket. It's sort of like a satin material, so I think it's perfect for spring. Cargo is another big trend we're seeing. I love the fact that this jacket has a drawstring around the waistband, so it has a very slimming effect if you pull the drawstring and make the jacket a bit more fitted, which is exactly what I did here. I also pushed up the sleeves, and then I just went with this simple white bodysuit, and then these are some amazing Good American jeans. They're like a straight, slim, straight leg. I love these, they're high-waisted. This wash is perfect for all year round. They're so comfortable. They do have some stretch in them, so they do a great job of really holding everything in, and they're not gonna stretch out that much, which I love that about Good American Denim. And then I just went with some Mark Fisher Kitten Heels. You guys, these heels are like the perfect spring heel. The heel height is very low, so they're very wearable. They come in like three different colors, white, gold, and beige. I think those are all really great neutral colors that will go with so many different things. And since they are by Mark Fisher, the price point is amazing. 
All right, the final spring color trend is also one of my favorites. This is metallics. Whether that's gold or silver, it doesn't really matter. Anything metallic is very on trend this season. So this is a beautiful Veronica Beard outfit and I wanted to show y'all, you don't have to wear a metallic shirt or a metallic jacket. You can just wear metallic shoes and you will still look very on trend. So I love this outfit. I'm actually gonna be on a podcast tomorrow talking about my divorce. So I will be sure and link that for you guys when it comes out. But this is a beautiful blue denim outfit by Veronica Beard. I love this blue strapless top. It has a beautiful silver zipper and then the matching pants you guys fit like a glove. I love these pants because they do have an ankle length. They hug your curves in all the right places. They're comfortable. I just absolutely love this outfit. In fact, if I had to pick like one of my newest, most favorite outfits, it would absolutely be this one. I think it's very modern and very chic. And I just feel like the best version of myself when I wear this outfit. So I wanna thank Halara for sponsoring this video. Again, everything that I am talking about will be linked down below in my description box. Now, let's talk about that dating story. So this was a few months ago. I went out with this guy. I actually was on Zoom doing Al-Anon meetings during COVID and he spotted me on the Zoom meeting and then he messaged me on Facebook. Somehow he found me on Facebook. He was very much of a gentleman in his comments. I looked his profile up. We actually shared a couple of the same friends. So I decided I would meet him out for coffee. So we met for coffee one day around 4 p.m. Great date. He was very like attentive to me. He was asking me all these really great questions like, Heather, what are you most afraid of? What are you most passionate about? And he did seem to come on really strong though, like hindsight, that's probably the one red flag that I did see. While we were talking, we were there for about a, an hour and a half. He said, well, hey, my therapist told me that I should make a list of what I want in my perfect partner. And I was like, no way, my therapist told me the same thing. So I also have a list. So he was like, oh my gosh, for our second date, I will call you tonight around 8.30 and we can share our list with each other. So I was like, that's perfect. So he walked me to the car, he did the little side hug, and then I drove home. I was going to wait for his call that evening at 8.30. Well, 8.30 rolls around, ladies, and guess what? He did not call me. Nine o'clock rolls around, he still hasn't called me. 9.30 rolls around, still hasn't called. 9.45, I get a text from him saying, oh my gosh, I accidentally fell asleep on my balcony. I'm so sorry, can I call you tomorrow? And you know what? I just kind of got this bad feeling deep down on the inside of me and I was like, this was like literally the first day you had to impress me and you've already failed at that. And I didn't really like, like him a ton anyway, so I decided just to call it off. So I basically texted him back the next morning and said, you know what, I'm so sorry. I didn't really feel a connection with you. Best of luck to you. So anyways, that's a short dating story. We only went on one date, but let me know if you would have done the same thing down below in the comments, because I always love hearing from you guys. So for more style information, you can head over to my blog, SoHeather.com and on Instagram, I'm so Heather blog. And if no one has told you yet today, I love you. You're beautiful. You're worthy. And I will look forward to seeing you in my next video. Bye-bye.